You come here where you're not wanted. You eat our food, you pollute our city with your stink, and you refuse to help the storm folks. We haven't taken a side because it's not our fight. Hey, maybe the reason these Grayskins don't help in the war is because they're Imperial spies. Imperial spies? See why we let these Dark Elves live inside the walls. We should kick them out like we did to the Scalebacks. You say that again, and I will kill you. Slowly and painfully. And I will back him up. There's no place here. Me neither. Now, I'll give you five seconds to clear off and don't come near me again. Five, four, three, two. I need to ask you to stop. Have I made myself clear? Damn you. This has ruined my entire day. Good. Glad we straightened that out. Hold it there. Keep your distance. What happened here? Another girl killed. This is Susanna, from Candlehearth Hall. Served me a drink just a few nights ago, but I can't say I knew her. <laughs> well done, boys. <laughs> Another. This has happened before. Susanna's the third. It's always the same. Young girl killed at night. Body torn up. Are the murders being investigated? We are stretched thin as it is with the war. Nobody has the time to spend on this. Not pleasant, but it's the truth. Could you use some help? If you want to help? I'm going to examine the body before the rats can get to it. Very well. I will be happy to help while I'm here, but I have someone to deal with first. Oi. You. You a dark elf lover? Get out of our city, you filthy piece of trash. I don't like your attitude. Don't like it? Don't think I can take you? One hundred percent say I can punch you back where you came from. You're on. Alright. Fists only. None of that magic stuff either. Let's go. Oh, it hurts. Bring it. Hey! Ugh. This is for everyone you have offended. You touch my allies and threaten them, and that is what you get. That wasn't a fair swing. You lost. Give me my money. Who's the big one? Lydia, shut up. You lost. Money. Yeah. Here. That was for Lucifer and Inigo. And if you ever threaten them again, it won't be fists I use. It is good to see you again, my friend. We got some time to talk. That was for you guys. You this is where dreams come to die. Let us not go out our busy day longer than necessary. I agree. But first, let's go talk to these witnesses. Before they all head home. Ah. Wow. This is horrible. Hello? Always sad when someone has to die. Did you see what happened? Sorry. I thought I saw a fellow running away, but didn't get a good look at him. Okay. Another one. Terrible. Did you see what happened? I heard a scream and came running, but she was already like Those this. wounds are horrible. I got here. Always sad when someone has to die. Have you heard? This is a shame. Did you see what happened to her? Uh, no, sorry. But I did notice that her coin purse was still intact, so whoever did this wasn't after gold. I'm going to keep preparing the body, if you'll excuse me. What could it mean? The return of the Dragonborn? Uh, and who among us could possibly hold that honor? Just quickly. My uh, job's simple enough. A boy's ghost wanted his much. remains buried properly. Will you see to it, priest? You've done well. Thank you. Here, this is for you. As if Skyrim didn't have enough outside. Thank you. Now we've got mercenaries from Hammerfell strutting about. Excuse me. You've been seen in the company of the. No, I haven't. <coughs> path you're on Don't know who they are. I've spoken to wit the witnesses. Just like always, nobody saw anything useful. 
bastards escaped again. There might be more to us if you'll let me help. Look, friend. If you think you can do better than the Legion of Guards, be my guest. You'll need to talk to the steward, though. We can't just let anyone go around claiming to be on official business. If he's willing, then we'll talk. Very well. Was I in your way? Please. No. No. Okay. He's he's sticking with her. What did she give us? Oh, it's a book. Well, uh. Luckily, Windhelm is cold. Goodbye, boy. I. I hope that you uh, sort out what you need to. All right, let's keep moving. We'll do. Blood on the ice. <sighs> Lucifer, are you going to be okay entering there? I hope so. He's a true Nord. He'll come around. Don't be so sure of that. We've intercepted couriers from Solitude. The Empire's putting a great deal of pressure on the White Run. And what would you have me do? I'm going to take off my hood, out of respect. The last thing I want to do is start a battle here. I suggest everyone's on their best behavior. He's against us. He knows that. They all know that. How long are you going to wait? You think I need to send both brothers to all the men? We'll just avoid them. Lydia. I'm not much of a strategist, but Lord Ulfric listens to my counsel all the same. Uh, I've heard about the murders. These are difficult times indeed, when men stalk their brethren like beasts. My men are stretched thin as it is. If you offer your aid, I gladly accept. The guards will be told to assist you as necessary. I'm happy to lend a hand as much as I can as well. Very well. What can you tell me? Any luck finding the butcher? No. Travel safely. It's dangerous out there. Uh, hey! Sorry. Soldiers a long time. We know the price of freedom, but people are still waiting. He has a bellowing voice. Good day, Captain Lilligo. The townsfolk call me Captain because I used to be a sailor. They're talking about murders. Terrible shame. Though. Seems we have a killer on the loose here in Wildhelm. He's claimed three victims that I know of. Though maybe there's more that haven't been found yet. All lovely ladies too. Let's hope the guards find that demon soon and introduce him to the headman's axe. Fair winds and calm seas. That's an old sailor's talk. Hmm. I don't know why it instantly progressed me onto the next part, but sure. Uh, uh, I guess we need to uh, go back and talk to your lift then, because. <clears throat> don't don't mind me. <clears throat> hey. I followed the blood trail from the uh, from the tomb to this house. It seems to be unoccupied. 
It might be worth casting your leaf. Thanks, Inigo. I appreciate that. I love being able to voice act and solve my own problems. Hopefully, uh, he doesn't notice. <coughs> Yulith, I'm sorry to disturb your rest for the third time tonight. How goes the investigation? How do I get into Herogen? Vega Shatter Shield's old place? It's been abandoned ever since she was killed. I think her mother, Tova, has the key. Very well. Thank you. Let me know if you have anything you need. Thank you, Lydia. I appreciate that. I think we should probably rest till morning. <sighs> At least we're in the warm. In fact, while I do this, you want to ask me something. I am all ears. Let's relax here. Okay, I will unwind a while. Lucifer, you too. You want to talk? What do you need me to do, old oh, Thane of White Run? <laughs> I guess we're done. Nope, we're not. Uh, what is it? Wait, uh, can he relax, or can he just? I need you to wait here. I'll be here waiting for you. Still here. Okay, uh that's cool. Uh very well, right. Let's chill till the morning. Ugh. I can't be bothered to pay for a room. Just a quick nap. Ugh. Ugh. Jesus, I fell asleep at the table. Good day. Indigo. Doing man. Another day, another blessing. Let's have a chat. What is on your mind? Losing yourselves full of arrows, I take it you prefer scenic. Yes. I have never been very good, though. We need to I take that bit off you. Songs, but sometimes it is more fun just making up words as I go along. The improvisation keeps the mind sharp and boredom at bay. If I asked, would you sing something while we're traveling? Maybe, but nothing too serious. I would rather save my proper songs for the Bard's College. For now, anyway. Why? Well, I know it is silly, but my songs are special to me. I would rather perform them in a special place. However, we will see. Let's chat. Yes, why not? Why do you like, uh, do you fear death? No, I fear reincarnation. If I came back as a chicken, I don't yeah. know how I would go about ending my life. Today is what matters. I could run at a saber cat, I suppose. No, that's true. But today is what matters. Every day could be your last. Unless you have a bad memory, then every day is your first. You're true. You are a funny fellow, Inigo. No, no. I would never have made a good jester. I am far too handsome. I think that's enough chit chat for now. Fair enough. Mind if I ask you something? Of course. What do you want to know? Tell me about yourself. Some people say I talk too much. Maybe it is true, but when we are up to something sneaky, I will fire away. Okay. Okay, talk to you later. You know what? I feel like this is a good place to uh, rest for a little bit. Lucifer? What is it? It's honest work, just a bit dull. 
Enough waiting, let's go. Alright then. Hope whatever you needed done about me was boring. <laughs> do what you love. Love what you do. A good 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 suggestion. Everyone should take his work seriously. Where's the recorder? There must be an end to this hardship. Ah, she's there. Okay. Alright, we're actually gonna go out, leave Recorder and Lydia here. And nab Indigo. Kingdoms all falling into political unrest. Indigo, ah, you're here. Yes, my friend. Follow me. I'm right behind you. Okay. I'll come back to get you two in a bit. But I like my uh, protection squad out here, just in case the killer decides to come pay a visit. Right. Tolvis Shadow Shield, right, boys? I'd love, uh, I am going to work on it, so eventually, my plan was the Blades HQ, but I want to place, um, where I can have people who, um, just rest and I can modify my party, you know? But Inigo and Lucifer are always going to do that. Oh. You know what? Let's try and just get in, like, no pressure. A master lock. Could be embarrassing. It could be very embarrassing. Ah, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Ah. Yes. Aha. I still have it. We didn't have to disrupt a grieving mother, that's something. On the marks on the floor, it looks like this boss box this box was pushed against the wall recently. Beware the butcher, the killer who haunts the streets of Windhelm. These calamitous times bring out the worst in people. Don't become the next victim. See Viola Giordano if you spot any suspicious behaviour. The plans are coming together swimmingly. I found good sources of bone, flesh, and blood, but thus far a good sampling of sinew and marrow have escaped me. No matter, the city is swollen with contemptuous fools who will be missed by nobody. Last night was I was almost able to corner Susanna as she left Candlehearth. Idiot guard showed up at just the wrong moment and I had to turn her out. Just after a stroll and so forth. There'll be other chances, but the time is drawing near. I think back to my time in Winterhold. All the wasted mines up there in the towers. They only explore the magic. They already know, I am discovering new magic here. Something deeper than the cantrip shenanigans of fire and light. This flesh magic is older than us. Perhaps older than the world itself. I am tugging at the corners of the fabric of the universe, and where it bunches and folds is where I shall create my greatest triumph. One more attempt at the candle hearth girl. She's proven to be a bit too cautious, but those strong joints of hers should contain the most exquisite tendons. Worth the effort. The night. Ugh. Sick bastard. Makes me revolting. Okay, let's keep moving. Audrey seems to be now for a rule for some reason. I think this floor is rotten. You think? How can I help you? Hey. <laughs> I'm not gonna say it here. Got your back. Something on your if I lived here, I'd be tempted to accidentally burn the place to the ground. Lads, I think we might have found. Oh, yes, gross. 
It's built to some unknown magic, by the looks of it. It looks like someone's using body parts towards some gruesome end. Let's find out. 17 tendons and assorted ligament, 173 fragments of bone for assemblage, approximately 4 bucketfuls of blood, nor preferred, 6 spoons of marrow, no more than 2 from a fire, 12 yards of flesh before cutting. Star scrying to the edge of the ice mine, look to the lights where the souls dance, revealing all the time when a spark will revive, when the rotted unites under most skillful hands. Translation from Ultima text, as in interpreted by the Aelids and first transcribed by Ultima, Previdence and authority unknown, soon. Hmm. Weird. Very empty. Clearly, who it's all documents have moved out. There is a bit of over there on that wall. I wouldn't be concerned about that. But yes, this house needs a lot of work. Great place if you want to catch a cold. You both sound so depressed being here. I can understand why. It's not exactly a lifting atmosphere. Maybe we missed something in that room. This house has a bad past. It does indeed. I am looking for an amulet, but I don't remember where it is. There is no need to push. I'm sorry. Ah! Okay. Well, we've got clues. I don't know who I... who is responsible, but... her name. She seems like a good place to start. Where would she hang out? If I was a Viola, where would I be? I doubt she'd be in the palace. Uh, I wish I could, but every city I go to apparently wants more gold to let them in. I'm trying here. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. Lydia, you haven't happened to see a woman called Viola, have you? You. Good to see you. No, it's not. Order. <laughs> I want it, but I can't. I can't just steal it. As much as I want to. No, she doesn't seem to be in here. could be around any corner. What can you tell me about the butcher? I've been following him for months now. Well, not actually following. Trying to find him. The guards won't help. The people won't help. I'm the only one who thinks he can be caught. Okay. So why can't the guards help? They say they're too busy with the war. I say, what good is winning a war if we're still terrorized by one of our own? It's a fair question. But I found this journal in the killer's lair. Huh? What's it say? It sounds like a necromancer has been experimenting. 
Woundfirth. There have been rumors swirling about him for years. As long as I remember. Uh... But he's a dangerous man. That's why they call him the Unliving. I wouldn't approach him directly. This information needs to go straight to the steward. He'll listen to you. Okay. Well, I mean, seems a bit obvious. Like everyone would assume it'd be. What's his name? Hmm. Very well. I mean, we found the evidence. We can allow the uh, steward to make his own assessment. He's a true Nord. He'll come around. We've intercepted couriers from solitude. Good day. Any luck finding the butcher? I believe the killer... Do you know what this amulet is? I've never seen anything like it. I would take this to Calixto at the House of Curiosities. He has a good eye for strange trinkets. Might even give you a bit of gold for it. Ah, I don't wish to part with this just yet. I've heard the killer might be one for a living. That's quite an accusation. I assume you have proof? Someone's been practicing necromonies in necromancy in Hergerim, and Viola thinks it's Wundfirth. Well, come back when you have some more evidence. I think you're on the trail. Very well, we will go to Calixto then. He was one of the witnesses, I believe. Alright, let's keep moving. I hope uh, I'm probably going to pull a poll on Twitter and just see if people want to see when I stream like side quests and stuff. Because I could easily put this on YouTube, but I thought it's nice to have just Rune not going through the Dragonborn stuff. Because um, obviously that's his main sort of, like, you know, thing. <laughs> but, I mean, I, I thought it would be cool if, uh, yeah, he had some other stuff. Hi, mister. Uh, would you like to buy some flowers? Of course, sure, what do you have? Not much, but I hope you like them. I'll buy the nightshade. Thanks. Thanks for talking to me. Not a problem. <laughs> Sweet one. Ugh, this is really a warren. Well, looks like we found a place. Lost? Good to see you, Calixter. Welcome to the House of Curiosities. I offer a brief tour for a few coins, or you can simply browse at your leisure. Do you know anything about this amulet? Let me see. <laughs> oh, yes. This is the wheelstone. It's an heirloom symbol of the power of Windhelm. Traditionally, it's carried by the court mage. I would, uh, for a piece like that, I could pay 500 gold. Shouldn't the court mage have it? Woundforth? Bah. It's purely ceremonial, and he has no use for it. Besides, I wouldn't want to be the one to give it to him. It gives me the creeps. They say he dabbles in necromancy. I think I'll hold on to it for the time being. Suit yourself. It's only of value to collectors, though. Good luck finding anyone else who will appraise it that highly. Well, thank you for your help. Till the next. We might have a browse while we're here, hey, boys? What do you think? Use for more soup spoon. Dwemer stuff. Well. It is certainly strange. It was nice speaking to you, Calixto. Thank you. I don't know why he wanted that amulet so bad. He said it was purely ceremonial, but... Could use the money. Ugh. I don't think it's worth it. Not until the investigation is concluded. All right. I think we have our killer. Will you spare if, it, a few if the ne if someone? the necklace is typically carried by the court mage and necromancy's been practiced, this wound first supposedly dabbles in it. It's probably good to. Uh, I don't know. 
I'm not a detective, but you're the investigation. I believe the killer is Wundworth the Unloved. That's quite an accusation. I assume you have proof. We have an evidence of necromancy in Founders Amulet. I don't want to believe it. Wundworth has been a trusted friend to Ulfric for many years. It pains me to see that the whispers had truth to them. Wundworth shall be apprehended. The streets of Windhelm are now safe. He knows that. We all know that. Well, we did it. How long are you going to wait? What is on your mind? Who rules from here? Some depressive <clears throat> Yeah, um, I always like doing it. Um, cause it's a bit different. It's a bit unique. Um, but yeah, it's, it could be done a lot better. Um, right. Please, someone do something. What do we do? Yes. Ah. For Skyrim. Ah. Ah. I don't usually get involved in the war, but he threatens innocent people and he just shouldn't have got caught. Right. I think we can pick our friends and leave. Come on. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. Good to see you. Lydia. Hmm? Actually, mm -hmm. I forgot I have to do an annoying setup. Oh. Well, we solved a mystery. I guess it's time to. Uh... Such a shame what happened to Susanna. Her beauty was the only thing worth suffering this place for. I agree.